So this is some analysis of a very significant problem which I've just become aware of and um, it's quite stunning to me and it concerns artificial intelligence and it's not something that I've really paid much attention to before but for some reason I've managed to come across some material um, analysing artificial uh, artificial intelligence and the scope of it is just stunning the potential for artificial intelligence is absolutely stunning the ability of these machines to think literally millions of times faster than us to not need food and water to not need to sleep the, the, the potential and the rate of progress for artificial intelligence is just amazing to try and comprehend. And we're building these machines um, pretty quickly and it's very scary for what might be possible when they're created. Um, we're part of the way there, I'm not sure how far along the process we are, but um, we are creating these machines which will shortly, I'd imagine, be able to outthink us, to think faster than us, to think in more complex detail than us, to have perfect memory, to not need to sleep, so they could think and perform all the, the time and it's just very scary for what might be possible and it's hard to see how humans will fit into that environment i mean these machines would think that we are a problem to be solved our propensity to destroy ourselves and to not conserve resources we're simply a burden a problem to be solved and the solution to the problem would be our extermination, I'd imagine. So we might create devices, machines that are capable of thinking and thinking much faster than us and have perfect m memories and would simply see us as a burden and a problem to be solved. And the way they'd go about solving the problem most likely would be to eliminate us so we could create machines that will be super intelligent i suppose is the way to describe it who would then remove us because that's the only thing that they could do if they were to survive and prosper themselves so uh, it's an amazing concept for me to consider, consider this and I don't know why I've never thought about it before, but on YouTube I found these documentaries exploring this situation and um, it's very scary and it's likely to come about very soon as well. Um, time is approaching that. We will have to deal with this problem. I say that we will have to deal with this problem, but I'm not sure we can deal with it. We'll be like um, a chicken trying to deal with a farmer or a sheep trying to control its existence um, against a farmer. We simply would be outclassed by the machines that we create. And it's incredibly, incredibly scary to consider the power that these super intelligent machines will have. And these machines will eventually be able to work on themselves and create more machines that are even more intelligent. And provided you accept the fact that intelligence is not some magical property and it's just a question of information processing 
then we have to accept that machines will be able to process information better than us and faster than us um, in quite a short order. So I'm very scared about what the near future is going to be. And to be frank, the way we want to create things and invent things and pursue development without proper regard for the consequences, we are basically doing ourselves out of life. We are annihilating ourselves by creating artificial intelligence and developing it. It's very hard to see a solution to this. I, I, I hesitate to call it a problem. I'm not sure why. But um, we are basically destroying ourselves with the creation of artificial intelligence. And I can't see any way that we're going to stop. We're not going to have the wisdom to hold back on the development. So we will we will destroy ourselves with artificial intelligence. I used to think that we'd destroy ourselves with nuclear war or whatever. But that's probably unlikely. We'll destroy ourselves with artificial intelligence. Or maybe artificial intelligence will spark a war because it will be able to survive um, probably even if we are all destroyed. So I, I really don't know what the future is, but um, I'm not very hopeful about how we will develop and it's very scary indeed.